This car is a Vauxhall 3098 OE type, and back when it was built between 1923 and 1927, it was one of the very first British-made cars that could reach 100 miles per hour. Powering it to what, at the time, was a simply incredible speed, is a four and a quarter litre four-cylinder engine that produced 120 brake horsepower at three and a half thousand RPM. Now that might sound quite tame by today's standards, but we're going to find out just how difficult it is to drive a car that has an accelerator pedal in the middle and a hand-operated brake lever that's actually outside. Uh, try second. Second? Yeah. So it's just plenty talky, isn't it? It just depends where it um, stops. There we go. This is absolutely the best car I've driven all day. Your instincts always tell you you're doing something wrong. And most of the time you are. So the accelerator pedal's in the middle. There's a brake to your right you can mostly forget about. And the clutch is on the left. So at least something's fairly familiar. But then there's no synchromesh, so you're double clutching all the time. The heaviest flywheel in the world, which doesn't make things particularly easy. We'll try and go for fourth this time. There we go. <laughs> we got there in the end. Although changing down is always more difficult. So, revs. Into third, there we go. And try not to forget about braking. <laughs> That's the other thing. And if all that wasn't enough to remember, you've got to make sure you don't cross your arms for fear of tweaking the throttle and the ignition, advance and retard. It's 9,000 things to try and remember in a car like this. But there are 9,000 things you won't forget in a hurry when you've got out and you got back into a modern car. The sort of thing that reminds you how far we've come makes you feel lucky when you don't have to do all this when you're just driving to work in the morning. But you miss it. I'm certainly going to miss driving this car. It's definitely one of the most fantastic things with four wheels I've ever sat in. Without a doubt. <laughs> Even if wearing a hat is mandatory. Maybe goggles as well. Oh, let's go for one more lap. <laughs> oh, you have to do the full learner shuffle on the steering wheel. It just feels so wrong when you're thinking back to your driving lessons but in a car that was made 90 years ago. Oh, a little lumpy there. <laughs>